Hi guys, welcome. There is some news regarding Qtile and the Arch Linux logout. So there is a new version of Qtile that came in and suddenly the Arch Linux logout was smaller. It was not full screen. Thanks to all the efforts of Fennec who kept like a pit bull looking for the code, finding all kinds of ways, like, like three, four ways. Now I've been the beta tester for it and so that doesn't work. Yes, it worked with XFC, CHA, DWM. There is Dusk and Qtile. Right? Several desktops have been tested. Not all desktops have been tested. But let's also put again, right? Um, say again, a video where you know it's no way safe to use advanced installation for the ones prior to right prior to 11 sorry my mistake i was talking and i was not concentrating so what i need to do is make a clone from this one clone and then control a so i'm going to use qtile but qtile is built prior to all these plasma changes so plasma changed its well no arch Linux changed the plasma reference and gave it a number five behind it so anything with 23.11.03, in a few days it will be out there. That will work just fine. But anything older, so if you go back to SourceForge and all the sources where the ISOs are, then the one from September, which is the one from Qtile, we're going to install that one, you can't use advanced. That's it. That's all you need to remember. All these things work as long if you don't use advanced so nvidia or not you choose it's just for box so the first line is good so we'll just go through the motions here i'm not going to record everything and then we're going to focus on the new code that fennec wrote for the qtile package the arch linux qtile git package and for the arch linux logout so both of them need to come in and it, they will when we update. And then if you do super X, your Arch Linux logout is big again. Basically, that's the message. So if you say, okay, whatever, I'll update and do a scale. Remember, right? The ETC scale, the config is there. It's not in your home directory, it's there. So either you do use the scale command or you copy paste it manually, or you just compare between folder one and folder two. And then you'll be good. So never this one anymore, right? All the guys prior to 23.11.03, you're never going to choose that one advanced. All right. This is always good. This is always good. This is just bits and bytes going from A to B, basically. And advanced has so many parameters with where it can go wrong. In this case, the renaming of Calamars. Uh, renaming of Plasma packages, sorry. <laughs> install install now and let's wait for everything to boot up again all right let's go for it so restart now remember if you're going to go for the easy it's back in time right we're now september so all the updates have to come in september october which means often arch linux key rings but i don't think this time around but let's see one of the things to learn, certainly now, and then to teach, right? Certainly now, is the backup scale. So everything is working fine. Control C, Super X, that's the one we want, right? That's the one we want. And Qtile did an update. The application Qtile from the GitHub from Qtile sent us a new update and it broke. So first of all look at uh, this here super x do you see the bar up here later on we'll have the solution without the bar and this going to full screen if you do all the steps right so if you update the system you'll see that we're gonna get lots of things update is good as well so it's maybe not that much let's have a look one one Oh no, just the one. <laughs> okay, cool. So for Plasma, it's just that one that's going to change, but it's a lot of information that's coming in. And like I told you, the Arch Linux, uh, maybe not. Let's have a look. So the Arch Linux 
Yes, let's log out or let's log out. A, A, A. We're getting there. So we're jumping. Yeah, it's correct. It's the new version that's coming in. So this is new. And this is new. All right. We're jumping here from June to October. And we're jumping here from, again, June to October. Fourth release. So we've been trying to figure out what to do, how to change it different ways and I think Fennec gave came up with a very good solution indeed. If window Arch Linux logout is there, hide the bar and get full screen. So let's hope that this is better in well to with withstand all the changes that Tutor still gives us. So this is a key which is a benign key meaning if you say yes it actually works, right? Thank you, super. And otherwise, it's sudo pacman minus s arch linux keyring. I forgot one thing to do. That's too late, I guess. <laughs> backup scale. <laughs> Sorry, guys. <laughs> so, with backup scale, you see the old version, the old code. And um, I forgot to do that. Talking, talking, blah, 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 right? I forgot to do that. Result is if you go for Thonar, Ctrl H, you get a backup of the scale. And I would like what I wanted to do is compare between the prior the update and after the update. So that ship has sailed. As sure as I'm not fast enough, I think. Was I fast enough? or not. We'll see. Anyway, um, this is not a way to open things, right? This is not the way to open things. F12, Velo. There is development. Dev is a shortcut on the ISO and Velo is the rest of development. The, so Velo is basically this. <laughs> Everything is locked. What I'd like to install is Sublime Text, is Melt, and other stuff like that. So we'll have to wait for this one to be able to do a Villo. All right. So Villo. Sublime texts, platinum searcher, bin, melt, and that's it. That's what I like to have. And if we do a backup scale again, let's see if there's a difference. <laughs> that was a bit too quick. Too eager. Compare. Show me the ones that are different. And I think we're got it in the nick of time, right? Let's see. Sure. Oof. <laughs> Thank God. And where's the rest? There's the rest. Okay. So I can explain it. So backup scale, you do it before you type update, right? Not afterwards. But okay, everything is okay. fine. And we can explain what changed. What you need to remember is that the correct code is in etc scale. That's where it is. So either you type scale, that's easy. Everything, but everything that's in here is basically control C, Eric, control V. In my case, it doesn't matter because, right, it's just a virtual machine. Now, if it's not, right, if you say, I'm just gonna grab Qtile, there's nothing different and nothing I haven't not did not change anything in these files fine that's fine too and you just copy paste everything to the eric.config Qtile and you can always decide to do a control C control V at any point in time so this is your reference that's yours copy C and control C control V and then um, go back maybe to be sure that you get this control C Eric config Qtile 
delete control V in and again you have something well later on to have a look what changed again a compare these guys changed so it doesn't really matter which, which one I choose now the backup scale or that one it's basically what happened to this particular uh, file so config pi is the one that we all use but I have a script that says in the auto start if you're in Belgium in BE if your keyboard is Belgium then override this one with a Zerti so my key bindings are in order the one the two the three is all different and this is yours and so that's QWERTY so these two guys are exactly the same so what changed we're using another um, module I guess it's called I don't know really the name so Qtile is extra so if you want to say um, yeah correct Qtile is extra so this is a copy that's the new bit okay so left is new right is old and you go over the things that you want to do for me is uh, group names Azerti so the difference is here that's changed already and here this is new so main none that's exactly the same thing hides the top bar when the Yarch Linux lo logout widget is used super X right but we need to check if the logout here is, is gonna so shows the top bar when the arch links is closed show it if it's there otherwise uh, if this is there then do this hide and otherwise show it again so that's a great idea you have to get the idea right and then say go for it let's test this so let us have a look just making sure we have Qtile here we have well I'll, I'll do a scale just to be sure everything is present because what I see is that the bar is still there which is not okay so what am I missing sudo pacman minus s arch linux logout git number four which is okay super x logout it's x maximalized but for some reason the bar is not gone so let's try it again that's better so we need to log out and log in and otherwise the q tile was not reloaded super shift r is something you can press then you get this which is nice it's not nice at all it's rubbish right but if you you're playing with your configuration fine play along play uh, change all kind of things and then log out and log in and then everything will be fine and there you go so super x anything that's available whatever is on there super x the bar up here is hard to see maybe so opacity a bit slower a bit uh, less did i now save it save settings maybe quickly something else let's yellow save settings okay super x and you get you see the bar is gone when arch Linux comes up bar is gone when the window is gone the bar is back so that was the idea of panic thank you very much so there you go that's the change we've made we don't know do not know how uh, it will work on the other 30 40 ISOs that we have and not everywhere Arch Linux logout is used anyway but we'll investigate once we build it mid November we'll build all 40 ISOs again since since this plasma change of all these names is there and we'll wait for another two weeks holiday will start soon and then exams and all that so mid-november will build 40 isos do the testing of this particular arch linux logout at that particular moment in time but if you already see issues on other desktops do tell us on discord that's it for me i think i've told everything 
So two things, an app that changes and a configuration that changes. So if you don't have the correct config, this will not work, right? The config that you have needs to be telling, needs to tell them, look, if this goes open, if this opens, you do this and this and that. So you can type in Arch Linux logout. If you don't see these guys, right? Nothing will work. And that's also because of the top there module that we're getting in Qtile. All right, enjoy Qtile, enjoy Arch Linux Logout, and learn and have fun. Cheers.